Hello and welcome to the Boozle Box. This is Prison Architect Alpha 10. Now there has been quite a large update in this new alpha and there's a lot that's been changed like this bubbly thing that's come up here is telling me that there isn't an incident going along down here which was these people having a fight there's new ironing boards and I'm basically I'm gonna go through this as quickly as I can and as fast as I can and then we're gonna try and have some fun so some new things ironing boards like I said prisoners now have to iron laundry as it comes out the washing machines uh, there are now new sounds as you can hear there is even more moaning and groaning and and I keep hitting the desk and, and people genuinely being peed off and annoyed. There's also this thing called the danger meter, which is part of the new anger stats kind of mechanism that's running behind the game and determines whether there's riots and things, which is also a new thing. There are now riots. Your prison can have big riots and have parts of it being taken over. All sorts of things like that. And that's the bit of fun we're going to have in a second. Uh, another new update. Guards shouldn't be able to see into rooms if they're not actually in it. So if I put this guard here, normally an aura would appear. Uh, but it does not. Also, Prison Architect has now got the Steam Workshop. So you can upload your prisons and have a look at other people's cool creations. And it's also available on Linux. Whoop whoop. Another new update in the reports menu. It now shows this line. This is the time. This is really useful because normally I was sitting there going, oh, it's about then. This now actually tells you what it is exactly. So we've gone through incident markers and the such. Now the, the really fun part, uh, which includes this one, the new emergency services, the new riot police and paramedics. Now hopefully we're going to have to call those in just a second. As you can see, this meter is going up. This meter increases when prisoners are angry because their needs are not being met. If they're locked up for no reason, or if there's riot police on site, or if there is a fight near them or riot occurring nearby. Uh, also, death induces this to go upwards. To decrease it, uh, you need to make your prisoners feel like they're being well treated, because obviously that's a good thing. Uh, also, you're going to want guards to be situated in the area, and recent punishments, so discipline, will uh, prevent riots. Now, there is a lot of guards in this prison, which is unfortunate. So, what we're going to try and do is start a riot. Now, to do this, there was a big bang. I don't know what the Big Bang was. Uh, but there is a bit of a riot going on. But what we're going to do is we're going to call a banger. And this is going to force all of the prisoners into their cells. Now this is going to make tension rise a little bit. Hopefully. To the point where there's going to be a bit of a big riot. He's running off with a pair of keys. This door's been broken down. Okay, everything is, is starting to kick off a little bit now. Let's sound the siren. Let's put the whole place into lockdown. And see if we can get this tension going up. 53 prisoners are locked up for no reason. They're getting a bit angry now. Come on, I've been starving them as families as well, so they should all be pretty annoyed about that. Okay, come on, we can do this. Right, so my devious plan. I have locked all of these prisoners up in this one room in the hope that uh, this is going to increase tensions. I hope this works, as there's a lot of noise going on. The uh, the bang up uh, or the lockdown sound for some reason is continuing to play. Tensions are rising. I'll bring you back when we have something interesting. Right. Well, for some blasted reason, that didn't work and actually ended up turning out pretty well because my prison seems to work efficiently when in bad things happen. So what I decided to do is build a holding cell, get loads of really high max security prisoners and hope to see this thing go up really fast. And they all seem to be really, 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 really peed off. So hopefully when these prisoners get moved into this holding cell, everything's going to kick off and there's going to be lots of blood and gore and, and good stuff like that. There seems to be a prisoner having a go at a... Oh, poor Jeff. Leave Jeff alone. He's a bat. Look at them all. They swarm. The guards swarm. Right. Once we get... Yeah, you get you get back on your post. There we go. Oh, there is in fact a 
riot happening. Well, it's not a riot, though. Oh, dear. Okay, right. Uh, this is going incredibly slowly, so my next plan is to fire all of the guards, and therefore there's no one to stop there being a riot. So let's do this. Fired, 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 and fired. So now they can literally run round and and no one um by the dead guard would be able to see what's happening. Unfortunately, I have just realized that's a bad thing because it means I'm not going to be able to see what's happening because of fog of war. So let's get three guards back in here. And hopefully I can get them to be deployed into there. There they have. And I can move them on to the security cameras. And so I can still see what's going on in the prison. Go over there. It's like Big Brother. So. We are continuing to rise. On anger. Let's see if we can get this. Let's bang them up. And cause a bit of a bit more anguish. Come on, get angry. Gar. Feel evil. Ooh. Something went bang. Not sure what. Can't I wanna see some anger. I wanna see some rage. Here we go. They're, they're getting angry now. This is good. It's going up. It's going up. People are fighting. Things are being destroyed. Let's start opening some doors and, whoop, and getting these doors open, locked into open mode. Let's open up this door. Oh god, there goes another bang. Oh, I don't know what it is. As we go, let's get these people nice and angry. Riot, 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 riot. God, that is scary. Okay, so, to try and make tensions rise a little bit faster, we're going to have a look at the emergency services. Now, these are the riot police and the paramedics. The riot police are actually one of the causes of riots, strangely. But if we get two of these guys in, hopefully, there's going to be a bit more anger. As you can see, there's now two little arrows, and people are getting very, very peed. We'll also get a bunch of paramedics in to heal up after this horrendous injury occurs. Although they do seem to have stopped at the door. Yes! Here we go! There is a riot underway. 25 prisoners are rioting. Where's it happening? Here it is. Woods tent. As you can see, this cell is now going a pink colour, which means that the prisoners have started to overtake it. Unfortunately, we don't seem to be able to get our riot van in here. Open. God, this is tense. Come on. Workman, unload the frickin' thing. Okay, I've managed to get the riot police out. And we're gonna take back our prison. We now have 29 people rioting. Okay, let's go. We're going in. This is tense. Oh good, they can get through the door. In we go, let's take this side first. Come on, we can do it. Normal guards will not actually enter, although we don't have any, because we got rid of them, uh, because they will refuse to go in as they feel threatened. Now, you can actually individually select them up here, or you can select the whole patrol and send them in to recapture an area. You know if it's recaptured, because it starts to go unread, unlike this area, which has been captured by the prisoners. I feel like a news reporter on a very, very dangerous mission in some war zone somewhere full of shower heads and deadly prisoners. Only 21 prisoners rioting. We can swell this riot do thing. Okay, let's send one, one squadron down here. Let's get the paramedics start to come in. Come on, guys. Start doing your heely wheely thing. Okay, this is tense. Where are they? Come on, guys. Let's take back our prison that we love so dearly. The paramedics are in. 
uh, going around and they will start healing people automatically. Alright, come on, let's proceed down the hallway and take the shower room. You can, it's just like a mini game. This is brilliant. Okay, I want them in here. One last part to take, ten prisoners rioting. As you can see, our danger level has started to decrease as we've started to overturn this horrific rioting event. I'm loving the music. Come on, we can do this. Get in there. Get stuck in. Here they come. They're all coming down now. Three rioters left. Get in here. They're in here. Get in, I think. Oh. And it's over. Thank God for that. Whew. Yeah, they got little sirens and everything. Ah, oh. we have managed to stem the tide of evil prisoners. Um, so as you can see now, it's quite hard to actually get a prison to riot, which is nice because it means that people aren't just going to get aggravated and angry uh, incredibly quickly, which means you're not going to have all that racket. So, the last thing to show is that you can dismiss these groups of people with the little X. I'm going to get rid of the riot guards, so we're going to leave now. I'm going to keep the paramedics, because we've got a lot of unconscious and dead people. A lot of dead. He's fixing a bed next to his dead friend. Um, how kind. I don't think we're going to have enough morgue slabs. Unfortunately. So as you heard, there's new music as well as all these other amazing things. I don't think I've missed anything. If I have... Uh, just point it down in the comments and I'll put it up as some annotation in the video or something. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it wasn't too long, me fattening around. It took me bloody ages to try and get this right to actually start. Um, if you did, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Bye!